Hey guys, Mike B. Rowan here. I'm just out here in the garage. Got a oil leak on my deer here. Uh, I had a, com a comment there I wanted to respond to. Uh, first off, let me preface this video with uh, I'm not a financial advisor and this is not financial advice. <laughs> uh, that being said, uh, he asked me, uh, you know, what would I recommend for a retirement account for, uh, you know, truck drivers, owner operators? And, you know, like, like I said, I'm not a financial advisor, but the, the, from what I do know, I can tell you what I do, <laughs> what I have done. Uh, I'm not in the traditional market in, by, in any way, shape, or form. I am out of that market. I don't trust it. I think it's fraudulent. Like I said, my opinion, not advice. Uh, I don't trust anything the government's got their hands in or a banker's got his hands in. If there's anybody in between me and my money, I absolutely do not trust them, not in the least. Uh, all of my investment is in three things, gold, silver, and cryptocurrencies, uh, crypto, pure speculation. And on my part, you know, I, I really think the blockchain and cryptos are going to be the future of the money system. I, I believe everything's headed that direction. Could be wrong. You know, don't, don't take my advice, but as far as the traditional market, anybody who's got a 401k or an IRA, one thing I do know for an ironclad fact, transfer that thing over, uh, cause your, your traditional IRAs and, and, uh, and uh, 401ks are sitting in a basket of commodities. You know, they're, they're in stock indices. And, you know, I got a feeling we're headed for a really big collapse, if not a total collapse. I mean, this, this one could be one for the history books because it's not just American housing crisis of 08, housing crisis of 08. This time it's going to be a global currency financial debt market collapse. I mean, I think it's going to be bad. I really do. And if you go back and look at history, the one thing that survives during big crises like that is gold and silver. You know, gold's got a 10,000 year track record. Silver, same thing. You know, platinum, palladium, copper, all those, you know, hard, hard, physical, tangible assets. You know, uh, there's no counterparty risk on those. You know, you, you buy them, you hold them. You know, when I say gold and silver, I'm not talking about buying on the stock market. I'm talking physical, precious metals mailed to you kept in your, you know, under your mattress, wherever, buried in the backyard, whatever you want to do with them, but there's no counterparty risk. Nobody else has their hands on them. Uh, that being said, those that have 401ks and IRAs, uh, I can recommend you to Beverly Hills Precious Metals. The man's name is Andrew. Uh, uh, he does a lot of interviews on YouTube with a gentleman by the name of Bo, Bo Polney, B-O-P-O-L-N-E-Y. Uh, he's a uh, religious man, Christian, uh, does a lot of interviews with Andrew. They're both Christian. Uh, Bo, uh, he likes to do charts and time things and things like that. I mean, it's pretty interesting material. I, I I've been following him for years. Uh, Andrew has a precious metal. He's a precious metal dealer out in Beverly Hills and his company is called Beverly Hills Precious Metals. And he'll have links to on those YouTube videos that you could just click on and take them right to it. But the one thing they constantly say is, is your for whoever's maintaining your 401k and your IRA will tell you, oh, it's a taxable event to roll those over to precious metals, blah, 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 blah. That's absolutely untrue. That's that's your broker, whoever they are, trying to keep collecting fees off of your money and trying to talk you into keeping your money with them. <laughs> but, you know, it is a non-taxable event to roll your 401k and IRA, which you can legally do tax-free, roll that over into a precious metals 401k IRA with the same exact rules. It's just you're changing from a basket of commodities and stocks or a, a basket of stocks and bonds and treasuries over to a basket of precious metal assets held in a vault with your name on them, you know, uh, and it is a non-taxable event. So, you know, the, no matter what your broker tells you, give old Andrew a call. He'll, he, that's what they do. They'll transfer it over. They'll, you, uh, I guess you contact him and you send him an email and then he'll sit, he'll, he'll call you back like 12 to 24 hours later, depending on how busy they are. And they'll set you up with a professional and just walk you right through the process. It's actually quite easy and it doesn't take a whole heck of a lot of time. But you know, if the, the gentleman that asked me about this question had a six figure, you know, six figure and growing 401k IRA, I would immediately as fast as humanly possible, transfer that over to a precious metals 401k or IRA just to be sitting safe because I mean, just go back and look in 08. What did they say? The first thing that got wiped out when the market crashed, Oh, everybody's 401ks got cut in half. Well, if you switch yours over to a precious metals 401k, you're not going to get cut in half. You're going to go up by orders of magnitude larger. You might three, four, five X your entire account while everything else is crashing because the rich money goes where it's treated the best. 
you know, the rich aren't going to sit there and take a loss. They're going to move to commodities and precious metals when the market's getting ready to crash. And if you look, you know, Jeff Bezos, uh, Zuckerberg, all these, these big fat cats, man, they're selling off hundreds of millions and billions of dollars of their own stock out of their own companies. They know something that they're not telling us, <laughs> you know, uh, but yeah, that's just all, that's all I could really say on the matter. Like I said, it's not financial advice. I'm not a financial advisor, but, uh, Myself, personally, if there's a banker involved or the United States government or the United States Treasury involved, I don't want nothing to do with it. I got my money completely out of the system. <laughs> but uh, yeah, just a quick video. I'll uh, get back to work on the mower. Got to fix an oil leak and get this, get this jungle of a yard mowed. <laughs> we'll talk to you all later.